Everyone is talking about how AI. AI. With AI. 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 AI is going to replace designers, make our skills outdated and turn creative into a commodity. I've heard it a thousand times at design conferences, on LinkedIn and in team meetings. But here's what I truly think. The designers who learn to work with the right AI tools are going to be unstoppable. Of course, I've said it enough and more. Not because the AI does the work for them, but because it removes all the stuff that was never creative in the first place. Let me show you what I mean. Over 700,000 presentations are created every day on this platform called Gamma. That's like 8 every single second. And their latest feature, Gamma Agent, isn't trying to replace designers, it's trying to make us better at what we are already great at. I've been using it for the past month and honestly, it's the first AI tool that actually feels like it gets how designers work. Not because it generates pretty slides, anyone can do that now, but because it can also help you with your stuff that eats up ours, but isn't where our value comes from. So in this video, I want to show you four specific things Agent does that genuinely matter. And that actually changed how I spend my time as a designer. You know, as a designer, you spend as much time designing as you spend preparing for a presentation, which you are going to show it to your leaders of the company. So let's dive in. Feature number one, multitask prompts. Most AI tools make you do one thing at a time change the layout, then adjust the color, then add more slides. It's like having an assistant who can only hear one instruction per day. But Agent lets you throw everything at once in just a single prompt. Let's say you're working on a design case study presentation. You realize you need to expand your research section, cut down some overly technical language, and make all your UI screenshot pop more, and reorder a few sections for better narrative flow. Normally, that's 30 minutes of clicking around, resizing things, breaking layouts, fixing layouts. But with Gamma Agent, you can ask all the four things in a single prompt. It handles everything in seconds, expands the section with relevant content, adjusts every image to be more vibrant and visually consistent, reorders the slides with proper formatting, all of these while ensuring that your brand colors, styles and design languages stay consistent across every change. This is the kind of stuff that makes you realize we are not just saving time, we are actually spending our time on what matters. The strategy, the story and design thinking instead of being a PowerPoint mechanic. That's the balance we are always chasing as designers, isn't it? Feature number two, web research and citations. But it gets better. Agent is connected to the web, which means it can actually research for you. Think about how we normally work. You're building a design presentation. You need current industry data. You open Chrome, you open five tabs, you skim articles, copy paste the numbers and you realize you need to cite your sources as well and then you add those tiny footnote texts that nobody can read it's time consuming and exhausting agent does this differently you just ask pull the latest statistics on mobile app usage patterns for 2025 it searches finds authoritative sources extracts what's relevant and automatically adds citations that's actual hyperlinks right in your tech not just footnotes only clickable sources this is part of why eight presentations are created every second on Gamma. It removes the research friction that usually kills momentum so that you keep creating in flow and the agent handles all the digging. And when you're working at scale, this kind of efficiency compounds across your entire workflow. Feature number three, content transformation. Now this next feature feels like magic. Gamma agents can completely rewrite your presentation for different audiences without losing the core message. I always keep saying that whenever you're presenting something, whether you're presenting the same thing to a business folks or to product folks or to design folks or to the CEO of the company, although you present the same thing, but the way you present the language that you speak so that they understand it better always changes. Let me give you a real example. Assume you create a comprehensive design case study. Its detail shows your full process, perfect for a portfolio review or job application. But then you need to present the same at work at design conference. Different audience. They want inspiration and storytelling, but not process documentation as such. Different tone, different depth, different emphasis. Or maybe you need to show it to a client who doesn't care about your methodology. They only want to see the business impact and results. Same work, three completely different presentations. Normally, you would be rebuilding the deck from scratch and spend hours working on the same project all the three times for these three different kinds of users. But now with Gamma Agent, you create one comprehensive version and then you ask the agent with just one Line. Rewrite this for a design conference, or make it inspirational, or reduce technical details, focus on creative storytelling, and so on. Now, rewrite it for a client meeting, focus on business outcomes, simplify design terminology, and add ROI framing, and done. 
Agent doesn't just swap out a few words. It actually reshapes the narrative. It adjusts depth, it changes tone, it reorganizes emphasis. It's like having three different writers who each understand their audience perfectly. This has cut my deck preparation time by more than half. You see, I do a lot of work at Swiggy and then I also speak at many conferences and gatherings. I usually talk about the work that I do at Swiggy, but I cannot do the exact same thing, the exact way I present my work at Swiggy internal stakeholders because they wouldn't have context and I wouldn't be in a position to share all the details to an outside audience that I can do for an inside audience at Swiggy. So this perfectly fits my use case and you will see it fits your use case as well. Feature number four, visual intelligence. And finally, let's talk about visuals because as designers, we are picky. We have standards. We know when something looks off. Gamma has generated over 1 billion AI images at this point. That's a billion. An agent ensures they match your brand colors, your style guidelines, and your visual standards. It's not just throwing stock photos at your deck and hoping something sticks. Whenever you're creating presentations, you can tell agents Agent. Use modern minimalist visual style with blue and gold as primary colors. Keep all images cohesive and professional. And it does. Every generated image maintains that consistency. But here's what really impressed me. The agent also suggests design improvements you didn't think about. This slide is too text heavy. Let me add a visual diagram. These three points would work better as an icon grid. That data would be clearer as a timeline instead of bullets. These are the kind of suggestion it makes. It's like having a design review built into the tool. Not an annoying way, but in a way that actually makes the work better. And because it's maintaining visual quality at scale, you can move fast without sacrificing polish. That's the balance we are always chasing as designers, right? Over 40,000 teams globally are using Gamma for exactly this kind of work. Not because it's flashy, because it actually solves the problem we have as designers and creators. If you're a designer, content creator, or anyone who needs presentation that actually works, try Gamma Agent. The link is in the description. It's free to start, so there's no reason not to test it. And I'm genuinely curious, let me know in the comments what you'd be using this for. How would you use content reshaping? What research would you automate? I want to hear how other designers are approaching this. If this was helpful, share it with your designer friends. They will thank you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.